Folks, Paul Chamberlain, the Air Force Guide Company from Beckley's Camping Center. And today we're going to share with you, this is a Momentum. This is a 328M. This was a demo unit that Grand Design used. So if you're looking for a great deal, here's your chance. It's going to come with all the warranties that a new one would come with. Now, this is going to come standard. This is a, um, your generator up front. So that's your... 5500 you can see you're gonna have two awnings on the door side so the first one is gonna cover this awning which has a TV and stereo speakers and then of course you can see the uh, one in the back there will get that back door for you this is coming with six-point auto leveling system the nice thing with this particular one is not overly too large and it's only two axles 16,500 pound dry weight you see the steps here, which are nice, and they do have the uh, feet that do adjust. You can adjust them to, um, you know, the different, if it's unlevel ground and so forth. But again, as I mentioned, this is the 328M. Uh, the nice thing with these is they do come with a three-year structural warranty. As you see, as you come in the doorway, you're going to be coming in to the kitchen area, living room area. You see the nice blue lights that they put in here, which is nice. Nice backsplash behind the sink area there, window, nice uh, counter space, flush mounted three burner uh, cooktop. That's a large 21 inch oven. You see you have your big, that's the convection microwave. Nice storage, very nice cabinetry, lots of room here. So you have a sliding glass door to go into the back. And then of course you have a four seat sofa here. And look at how large those windows are. Nice big windows, and a beautiful thing about this, they're looking out into your camping site. You're not looking at someone else's. As we pan around here, you can see the TV. That does pull out if you wanted to. Nice stone wall there. That's the imported Brazilian uh, stone there around that fireplace. It's more like a foam base, really. Um, and then, of course, you have your pantry right here. Good-sized pantry. Place you can put a trash can store you know your broom and so forth but lots of room this cabin space above here although it's a little bit out of my reach uh, it is lots of storage this is an 18 cubic foot refrigerator the nice thing with this is the fact that it does come with an ice maker some of you may not have seen that kind of an ice maker before but uh, they do actually do make ice contrary to what some people might tell you but the other thing nice with this this is an RV refrigerator but the difference with this is you actually get some air circulation like uh, versus the others that are out there. So this is the kitchen area. Of course, this is going to come, you have the AC here in the kitchen area. And that's going to blow throughout the camper. So you have uh, stereo speakers because it does have the AM, FM, DVD, CD, DVD player, Bluetooth capable uh, stereo. Let's go take a look in the garage area. So we have the sliding glass door. You can see that this has the party deck, has the, uh, the screen that comes down. It, it's gonna have the uh, fencing to go around and it also has the steps to go off the back. Plus you get two of these uh, reclining lounges. The other nice thing what they do with, the, um, with these seats is the fact that, you know, of course they do make the bed, but so you can sit it like this so three people can sit in here or you can pull down the little cup holder. It is air conditioned back here. You do have the ventilation for it. And on top of that, you have a 12 volt fan. So if you want to circulate the air, you can. And that light right up here, that can be set. It's off right now, but you can set that to be a sensor light. So once you walk in this room, it would come on, which makes it nice. This thing is equipped, uh, pre-wired uh, and everything and plumbed for a washer dryer here. You can put a TV back here, and of course you have some storage cabinets. As you can see, you have plenty of lights. And then of course you have a separate door that you could utilize for coming in and out. So let's go back in through the kitchen area and go take a look at the bathroom and the bedroom. As you can see, as you're going to go up the steps, this has the two-prong uh, approach for the um, vacuum cleaner system. So this part here, all you do is this thing would just lift up and it would come on and you just sweep into it. And then of course the other part here, you would just put your hose into that and you're able to vacuum up throughout the camper. 
no carpet on the steps, which is awesome. You don't have to mess with that. And also notice how that door for the bathroom is a pocket door. So it's never in the way. As you're coming into the bathroom, you see how they curved the counter? Just to give you more room coming in, toilet space, cabinet above it. And again, the big uh, 12 volt power fan, AC ducted, heat ducted into this bathroom. Nice big shower with a molded seat and molded shelves in here. And of course the skylight, which makes it nice. Medicine cabinet storage below. What else can you ask for? Now, as you come in the bedroom here, this is a actual queen bed, which means it's residential, 60 inches wide by 80 inches long. The benefit to you there is that your home um, queen set of sheets will fit this mattress. And this is a pretty comfortable mattress. But you have outlets on either side. You have lighting, as well as having, um, you have the AC back here. You have a slide out here, and that is going to be your um, wardrobe slide. It does have some drawers. The other beautiful thing about, again, with Grand Design, the way that they put their the beds here, this bed thing lifts up. It's easy to lift up. That's your table for the back, table for by the sofa. But you see how high that lifts up? It makes it very easy for you to access and put things away under the bed. And notice how easy it goes down as well. So this is the bedroom part. You can see a nice big window, nice good looking door there, TVs up here, furnace ducts are over here, carpeted. So this is a great opportunity for somebody if you were in the market for a toy hauler. But hopefully you uh, enjoyed this, um, this video. I appreciate you watching. And if you have any more questions on this particular RV or any other type of RV, just remember to ask for Paul Chamberlain, the Air Force guy here at Beckley's Camping Center when you call, if you stop by, or you send an email. Remember just Paul Chamberlain. I appreciate you watching, and I look forward to seeing you one day. Thank you.